Ah, I am so grateful. You did? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <sighs> you know it was your idea. No, I can't take the credit. I was just telling you what Mary Designer does every year and you picked it up. Now you transform this into a wonderful family get-together. We really had fun. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> um, you don't have to go now. It's so early. Let's go inside and have some oh, drinks. Please. Julie, I will go and attend to the children. They will go to school tomorrow. Okay. Hey, hey, that reminds me. What? Do you know that Mary is pregnant? Which Mary? She's expecting baby. It's a lie. I am telling you. Mary is pregnant. She is six months pregnant. Six months pregnant. Honestly, and she really kept it quiet. She'll be How? traveling to Canada next month. Wait, hold on. How did this happen? Whoa. She told me that she met with this new doctor that came back from America, a super gynecologist. That uh, his success is um, miraculous. Are Honestly, you I saw her one on one three Mary. years ago. Honestly. After how many years? I can say. God <sighs> can make babies from stone, honestly. <laughs> mm. I'll come tomorrow so that we'll just move on it. Okay. Yeah. No problem. Junior, do you want to stay with Auntie Ma? Do you want to stay with me? Stay with me. Oh! <laughs> but you have to go with mommy there's school tomorrow. You need to go to school tomorrow. All okay? right. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, girls. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mike. All right. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. We have fun. So? Do you drive? No. You don't. <laughs> Look at them. <laughs> Please drive and go. <laughs> Can you imagine, Mike? Let her do it. Men's world. It's okay. Don't worry. There's another day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Drive safe. And I advised you, let's cancel this party. Let's not have it this time. This is how it has always ended. Three years now. This is the fourth year. Let's stop doing this. I can't. I just can't. I just want, sometimes I just want the warmth of children around me, even if it's just for a moment. I understand that, but look at you. It always leaves you in tears of grief. Hmm? It's, uh, it's not always tears of grief. Sometimes it's tears of joy. Yes, the joy of expectation that someday, someday he will give me my own child. All of my friends, all my mates have children. Some one, two, three, four, even more. I know. God, what did I do? What did I do to deserve this punishment? Yeah. You've done nothing, babe. Come on. I walked for seven years. For seven years, I have begged God for the foot of the world, but he just wouldn't. We're going to have a baby, okay? I assure you. We're going to have our own child. I assure you. It's okay. Oh, my own child.
Doctor, you're my last hope. I, I have gone to a lot of places. I have done countless things, but none has worked. Uh, three years ago, I did fibroid operation and I was assured that everything will be fine thereafter. But here I am, back to square one. I gave up until my friend, my best friend, convinced me to see you based on what you have done for other women. Doctor, I am at my wit's end. I don't know what else to do. I don't know where else to go. I need for you to do the same for me, please. You don't know what I have been through. Please, you're my last hope. It's okay, madam. <clears throat> it's okay. Job. Okay. I have dealt with a lot of fertility cases in the last 30 years. Yeah. I actually trained and practiced in the United States of America and in Canada before I decided to come back home. Yeah. But part of my success story is the fact that I don't usually go into it alone. I usually go into my patients. So tell me, are you ready to help me achieve success in your own case? Yes. Good. Good. <clears throat> First and foremost, I want you to put a smile on this pretty face. Good. <laughs> you know, babies, love smiles and I'll tell you a little secret maybe you know maybe you do not know tension anxiety can actually prevent a woman from getting pregnant hmm. so the reason why I want you to keep smiling and what I mean smiling <laughs> from the bottom of your hearts okay <laughs> Thank you. It doctor. is well. Thank it you. is well. It is well. Mm. <clears throat> so, mm. we are going to start by running a few tests and uh, mm -hmm. carry out some x rays. Okay? Good. If I can read your mind through your face, you're like, I have done this several times. <laughs> True or false? Very correct, Doctor. You're going to do it again for me, okay? okay? And this time, with a lot of smile, plenty of smile, songs in your hearts, <laughs> eh? and a singing. <clears throat> What about your husband? Has he gone through any tests himself? Um, no, my husband is fine. He's quite okay. He's alright. I still have to confirm. No assumptions. Okay? Okay. He'll be available anytime you need him. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. <clears throat> alright. Mm. You're going to start running your test from tomorrow morning. Okay? Okay. I'm ready. Anything. I love that. Thank you very much. I promise me you'll keep smiling. I promise. I promise. Good. Somebody will attend to you, okay? Okay. Thank All you right. very much. Yeah. Thank you for your time. Yeah. One more thing. Sure. Keep smiling. <laughs> I win. <laughs> Thank you very much. Sir. All Thank right you. then. <clears throat> Nonsense. Madam. Madam, I'm waiting now. Give me my money. Which money again? Give me my complete my money. Madam, come out here, Joe. Madam, see. In the fight trouble, I know they fear your size. Give me my money now. You know they, you know they look face. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know they fear. This size, you know they fear you. Madam, you know they fear me. Give me okay, my money. Okay, now. Madam. 
complete my money, give my money. I they blame you. Hey, Pika, yeah, yeah, yeah. You still send anybody. I just won't give you. One I just won't give, give you. Give me. Uh, give, give Nonsense. <laughs> Nonsense. I don't blame you. Huh? Juju? Huh? Juliet? <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Hey, darling. Oh, How are you, Biola oh, Akintola Okafo? And you? Ah, uh, uh, you look good, darling. Is this you? Yes, so oh, life and direct. Mm. This is me. <laughs> <laughs> How have you been? Oh, I'm fine, my darling, and I've been in the north all this year. Oh, May wow. be precisely. But we located down here last year because okay. of the crisis in the north. Yeah. Yes, that's why we yeah. are here now. Yes, darling. Yeah. Ah. And how are you there? I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm good. <laughs> so, yeah. mm -hmm. what have you been ah, up to? Ah, my darling, I'm good. But you haven't changed at all. You don't hmm. want to be horrible like us. Horrible. Uh, <laughs> you're not horrible now. You're just, you know, chubby. Ah, if you say so, how my much? darling, after five children, somebody have wow. to, you know, large job. Five mm. children? Yes, lovely kids. Four boys, one girl. You know, after marriage, I was having children every year. My darling, hmm. it's not easy. <laughs> <laughs> That's so nice. Yes. That's so nice. Yes. And you now, how many do you have? Um, none yet. Don't say it again. You said none yet. Yes, my husband and I don't have children yet. <laughs> it's not possible. How can you not have children? When all those runs, girls for school, don't burn, scatter everywhere. Ejiro, Obi, Gloria, don't burn like it's ten. It's okay, Biola. When it's God's time, he will give us our own. <sighs> Amen, no. Mm -hmm. Oh, darling. It's so okay. what brings you here? Oh, my darling, you know I'm into contracts. I supply, I supply toiletries, maternity items, you know, babies, everything about babies. Uh -uh. And as a new person in town, I come to this kind of big, big places to introduce my business. Okay, yeah, that's darling. good. Yes, yes. Um, this is my card. Please introduce me to your friends for business. Oh, so. sure I will. <laughs> I need I all will. the content. Let me give you my card as well. <laughs> yes. yeah. Oh, thank you. So, um, to the glory of God, I own the largest food market in the area. So, uh -uh. yeah. That's what I believe. You live on the island? Villa, please. People live on the island. <laughs> hey, 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 my darling, I have to be here to see you. No problem. <laughs> I'm just a phone call away. My number is there. No, no, okay, no. I'll I'll store your number. I won't call you. I will be there. Life and die. A lot of catching up, you no know. A lot of jeans and all that. I love you. Take care. Hey, all Juju, right. my friend. We'll talk okay. about it. I'll respect to your friend. Ha. Right, bye -bye. Ha. Hey. Stop. Stop. Hello, Stamaka. Good afternoon. Uh -huh. Afternoon. I've been calling my brother, but he's not picking. Is he there with you? Oh, no, no, no. He's not here with me. I'm sure he, um, he's probably in court and he cannot pick calls when court is in session. Anyway, uh, we are organizing a befitting 65th birthday for mama, which is in two months from now. Oh, wow. That's, that's really, really nice. Mama deserves it. Uh, you will bring uh, 275,000 naira. 200 and? Why are you shouting? Uh, sorry, 275,000. Okay, that's not a problem. It, it, it's not a problem at all. Um, I would talk to Odili and we'll know how to send the money to you. How are the preparations? What's going on? Uh, I've told you the aspect that concerns you. And I'll talk to my brother Odili. Meanwhile, I will send you my account number for you to send your own money as soon as possible oh, okay okay no problem no problem auntie my my regards to everyone especially the children tell them i'll buy them gifts soon yeah we don't have time okay i'll tell them thank you comfort 
quite impressive. I'm really very satisfied uh, with your test results. Your fallopian tubes are through. Your ovulation is regular. Your ovarian count, not so bad. Generally, I think um, the result is very okay. No, 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 doctor. I, I was thinking you find something wrong and correct it. Or at least tell me I have a problem or there's something that needs to be done. I, I'm... Uh, madam, I, I don't get you. Are you trying to tell me I should find something wrong when as a matter of fact there's nothing wrong with you? No, I... <laughs> Madam, yes, I understand the complexity in fertility cases, which are oftentimes are way too complex. Okay. All right? Um, what I'll do is that I'm going to place you on some medication for at least one week. And then uh, let's see... Uh, if you can boost your hormonal level, and then um, after which I'd like to see both of you. I mean, you and your husband. Um, you think there's a problem with my husband? Uh, I haven't said so, madam. No, I haven't said so. Um, it's just that I like to exhaust every possible angle. Like I told you before, no assumptions. You know, oh. Do you have any problem with your husband no, coming no. to see me? No, 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 not at all. I already informed him that you wanted to see him. Oh, so. that's good. Okay. So he's away. Very well then. <clears throat> it's okay. Um, you will pass through the pharmacy. Okay. And then. Uh, Get these drops, okay? Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Doctor. And then one more thing. Remember our secret? Smile. <laughs> Keep smiling, okay? I will. Thank very you so much. Okay. Thank you so much. My regards to your husband, okay? He will hear. Thank right. you. Thank you. Juliet, sorry, Juliet, yes. You sure where you'll be here? Uh, yes, tell her Biola, her schoolmates. Her, her schoolmates? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, wait for me, I'm coming. Okay, okay. Hello, I'm here. I am you, I am you, I am you. My dear, so this is where we're hiding. Ah, ah. Juju, I see your house so beautiful, eh? Thank you. Thank you. Ah, imagine. Eh? And the furnishing, everything, I'm sure is imported. No, 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 no. We don't import things. We just buy from the showrooms here. Ah, ah, you're not serious, darling? I'm serious. Eh? Yes, you can find all of these things in Nigeria. Hey! hey, hey, hey. Ah, Juju. Hey. This, now I know why you're not working. Eh? Everything made easy. Not like people like also. We have to work January to December. Yes. Mm. Biola, don't eh? sound like that. You're sounding as if I never worked my, my whole life. I just resigned last year from Food Plus. Eh? Plus, I helped my husband set up his chambers. Yes, I set it up three years ago. Seriously? So it's not as if I've not been doing anything all those years. <laughs> You're lucky, darling. Very, very lucky you have a listening and understanding husband. Not like people like us who oh, marry ITK. He won't even allow you to help him. Mm. It's all right. Mm. My friend, sit down. Ah. Sit down. Ah. I'm not standing and talking. Sit ah. down, Yola. What ah. do you want me to offer you? Ah, ah. You know now we need to enlarge this course here. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, bamboo, eba, ewedu, you know, drink. Everything. It's all right. I'll give you what is available. Okay. Don't worry. Just sit down okay. and enjoy yourself. Eh? Give me you a second. Hey, Oluwami. 
<laughs> hey! Father Lord, eh? how can somebody make this kind of mother under this short notice? And she's telling me I'm not working. And, eh? Hey, oh girl. Eh? Money rituals. Well, what is my own? I must chop the money. I will not say in her pain, it's not my business. That's your husband's sister, right? No, come for? No, no, no. She's my cousin. What? What? <laughs> You're not serious. How can such a pretty girl be in your house in this condition? I don't get it. You don't get what? Eh? You don't get what? Haven't you heard of helps marrying the man of the house and sending the mother back in? What are you talking about? Don't be ridiculous. Comfort has been with us for over five years. She was, she was, she came here when she was barely 12. Uh, yeah, 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 12. Eh? Was she like this then? Has she got the arsenals and the mind you? All this packaging, was it there? Hey! Juju, open your eyes. Open it well. Eh? And make sure you remove the monkey hand from the food before it turns you Look, around. Look, Let's just say I do not have that kind of challenge. Can you eat your food, please? Okay. I'm happy me. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> hey! You really know my size. <laughs> I like it. Thank you very much, my Enjoy friend. Your meal. God bless you. <laughs> hey! Uh, mm, I'm dead. Enjoy. Mm. 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 You like it? <laughs> Very well, thank you. You're welcome. Viola. Thank you, Juju. You're welcome. Thank you. I've always been such a nice person. If not for anything, I would have asked you to drop me. <laughs> no, but you said you were expecting a visit. It's okay. Uh, no problem. You. Okay, you know what? Just manage this, eh? Uh -uh. Use it for transport. Money again. <laughs> It's okay, just you like take. to worry yourself. Take. Eh. Viola. Just okay. use it for transport. Okay? Thank you. God Please. bless you, Chichi. Ah, <laughs> Juju, you're too much. God bless you. Eh? Bless you. <laughs> oh, she's here. Open the gate. That's my friend. Ah, that's very nice. <laughs> <laughs> No problem. Don't forget me, Oja. Hey, Choba, how are you? I'm sorry, I'm late. <laughs> it's okay. Um, <laughs> this is my friend, Biola. We're in the university together. Okay. And Biola, this is my very close friend, Choma. Hey, hey, hello. Hey, Juju forgot to tell you that. Um, I used to say to she and her first boyfriend, Chris Quarrel, anytime they quarrel before, all the look came and swept off her feet and she forgot me. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Choma, Choma is my very close friend and she owns the best private school in the area. Ah, that's nice. You know, ah, if not for the distance, I would have brought my kids to your school to, to start studying. You know, this is the kind of environment that we stay where we were in the north before the crisis broke out and we, we came home. You know, I have wonderful kids. Four boys and a sweet girl. Bright children. Very, very intelligent, you know. Awesome kids. You will love them when you see them, eh? But I had to come home. You know, eh, my children are my life. Don't you believe so? Yes, <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Um, <clears throat> um, I wanted to give you my complimentary card, but um, you can just look through this one. Uh, so uh, that's it. Uh, God bless you. Eh? You know, I'm into supplies. Yes, she's, she's into supplies <laughs> yes. and baby stuff. Uh, so. Don't forget, please. Eh? Okay. <laughs> Juju, hmm? all right, me. Thank you. Eh? All right, take God care. God bless you so much. Eh? Thank you for Next coming. Time. Okay. Mwah, I love you, my friend. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> What is it? I don't like her. <laughs> I know, I know. Viola is an impossible character. She's quite boastful, but it's okay. 
Julie, from what she displayed here, she's not just boastful. I think she's vain. Foolish, in fact. Or rather, downright wicked. Sorry, I have never sounded like this about anybody. It's okay. I understand. <sighs> she has complex. Her. Serious inferiority oh. complex. And you know, people with complex are very dangerous. It's okay. It takes exceptional patience to deal with her. I understand. So what exactly does she come to do here? Hmm. I bumped into her in the hospital last week and she said she was going to come and spend some quality time with me because we went to school together. Uh, no harm in it, just for old time's sake. It's not as if we were even close in school. You know all those kind of girls that like to dabble into other people's business without being invited. <laughs> it's okay. Please, you need to keep this woman at an arm's length. I've always told you that you are too, too soft on people and they take advantage of that. Okay, I've heard you. I've heard you. The word is not fair. I have heard you, Choma. Come, let's go inside, cool. please. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. Okay, cool. Are you? Ah, I'm okay. Yeah, um... I'm seeing Dr. Edivia tomorrow. Have you said so? You mentioned it. Yes, I did. But what I didn't mention is that he said he wants to see you as well. Why? He, he said he doesn't like to work on like assumptions. So mm. I told him you're perfectly all right, that there's nothing wrong with you, but he just, just insisted. It's okay. I can see him. It's not a problem. It's just that I have um, I have cut in the morning, so I should be I should be free twelve one. Um, he's he will see you as soon as you anytime anytime you're ready. Cool then. I'll see him. Thank you. You're welcome. What? No, I, I I didn't think you were going to say yes. Babe. Babe. If it makes you happy, it gives me joy. So why not? I love you, babe. I love you, baby. I love you. From the bottom of my heart. Don't sing, please. I need you. For the rest of my day. Hello, Amaka. Hello, how are you? Yeah, how are you? We are fine. And your family? We are fine, my brother. Oh, that's good. That's good. It's also good to know that you and your family are doing good. I am calling because of the birthday. Yeah, I remember we had that conversation about mom's um, birthday celebration, right? Yes, yes. Yeah. It's on you now. I told you to, you know, send me. Uh, your wife is laying the whole thing. Pardon me, I, I didn't I didn't get that. Um your wife is delaying the whole thing. Amaka, what has my wife got to do with this? You and I had a conversation about this and I told you that I'll finance it. So it's on you to send me a book. Orderly. Orderly. Yeah? That, 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 that's Juliet. That your wife is is making you to turn back on your family. Amaka, I told Juliet not to transfer the money. 275,000 naira is bizarre. It's too much. Who pays that, that much, Fashwebi? And why would you hope that she would make a transfer when I already told you that I'm financing the entire thing? Sorry, yo. Sorry. Uh, Amaka, listen to me. My wife has nothing to do with this. Oh, yeah, she has nothing to do with it. Oh, Dili. Oh, Dili. <laughs> Juliet has made you turn your back on your family. And I don't like it. You know it. what? Knock yourself out, all right? If that's what you want to believe, Fine, live with that reality. Oh, because I'm tired of hearing it. Oh, yes, really. Oh, Juliet is the reason you we are no longer close to your family. Juliet is the reason we are no longer close as siblings. Juliet, this, Juliet, that. Leave my wife alone. Let this be the last time you call my phone and speak Please. such nonsense about Tell my wife. Look, Juliet is my wife. Right? I don't my want any delay at all. If I her way of life pleases me, that's all that matters. 
If you want us to do this and do it right, then draw up a budget for the celebration. Send it to me. I look at it. If it's fine, I approve it. If it's not, then I, we, we call it off. And if you want my wife and I to be part of that, Shelby, review, re, 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 review that budget downwards. Who pays 275 for Shelby? Sorry, yo. I know you always yes, support that's her. My stance. Yes. Why? But we shall see. Dilly. Yeah. Hey, babe. What's wrong? Why are you screaming? <sighs> You know what? I'll pay whatever. No, you, no, no, you will not. Calm no, down. no, you will not. Don't tell me to calm down. down. No, you will not. She keeps doing this and I keep letting go. Not this time. Don't let her ruin your day. 275,000. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. Who pays that much for Shabby? Calm down. You're just about leaving. What's wrong? It's fine. Are you sure? <laughs> Come on now. It's fine. Are you sure? It's fine. Mm -hmm. So, I'll be going to the doctor today. I'll call you when I get there. I know you will, baby. <laughs> Miss me. I love you. I love you too. All right. All right. If you don't call me earlier, I'll call you. I'll be waiting. <laughs> I'll be by my phone. <laughs> Bye, baby. Bye. Commissioner, Commissioner, Commissioner. Yes. <clears throat> yes, good afternoon, uh, Commissioner. Yes, Dr. EDB on the line, yes. I'm very well, thank you. Very well. Please, just a quick one. You remember my discussion with you sometime back um, a month ago in your hospital? Sorry, that in your office? Yes, yes. They're right here in my hospital. About these cameras? Yes, they're here. They are here. And they came with some supposed policeman. Yes. In uniform. Absolutely. Please. I need your men here, please. Please, I beg of you, please. Very well then. Thank you. Thank you. Huh? Is it this bad? That these criminals go from hospital to hospital looking for who to blackmail about stealing of children and trafficking of children and extorting money from people? What is going on in this country? No. Um, please, I'm here to see the doctor. I have a nine o'clock appointment with him. Okay. Is he on seat? No. He's not. Um, when is he coming back? In 30 minutes time. Okay. Please, can you have a seat down? All right. Thank you very much. Where is my 
my baby. What, what, what is wrong with you? What are you talking about? <laughs> Officer, this woman bought my baby from this hospital. She's conspired with them and bought my baby. Mother, what is my baby? What is wrong with you? Oh. What is wrong? What, what's going on here? My baby. What baby? You bought my baby. Where is my baby? Will, will you just keep quiet? Where is my baby? What is wrong? Where is my baby? Oh. Oh. for this nonsense will hear from me. Just a quick one. You remember my discussion with you sometime back uh, a month ago in your hospital? Sorry, that in your office? Yes, yes. They're right here in my hospital. About these cameras? Yes, they're here. They are here. And they came with some supposed policeman. Yes. In uniform. Absolutely. Please, I need your men here, please. Please, I beg of you, please. Very well then. Thank you. Thank you. Huh? Gosh. Is it this bad? That these criminals go from hospital to hospital? Looking for who to blackmail about stealing of children, trafficking of children, and extorting money from people? What is going on in this country? No. John, you, you, you should have been there to see what I saw with my eyes. It was, it was, it was ridiculous. I have told you that I will find the way we are. I like us the way we are. But no, she won't listen. Now see, a baby is going to come when a baby would come. What are we going to kill ourselves before the, the child gets here? These people were feasting on her, fighting. What would have happened if I didn't get there when I got there? Some idiot could have just killed my wife for nothing. Why? <sighs> Don't you let, look, all over the world, people are beginning to adopt kids. Let's explore that option. No. No. Oh, she must have a child. She must have a child. She must have a child. I understand, but come on. See what we're dealing with now. Oh, Dili, it's not easy as you think. It's so unfortunate this thing happened, but... You know what hurts me the most? You see, this whole, this whole thing could have been avoided. Because she had a dream. Oh, yeah, same scenario. She, she, she had a dream. Really? Yeah, she should have just have gone back there. It wasn't necessary. What is that list going yeah, on? Look, I don't know what's going on right now, but I'm going to tell you what will happen. My wife will not go back there or anywhere else. Nana Chongwa. For what? Huh? When it's God's time, we're going to have a child. Yes, DP, I can hear you. What? New developments? Oh, okay, okay. Sure, yeah, I can be there now. Yeah. All right, sir. Thank you. 
Um, the OP just called to say that there's a new development and I have to be there. So please, please, can you just stay with Gillette for me, please? It's okay. Alright, so I can run off and get back. Yeah, please, I have to get to the end of this. This is not right. <sighs> Alright. Whoever has a hand in this must be brought to book. Huh? Please. I'll okay. be back soon, man. Darling. Oh. We want to thank you for the assistance that you've rendered to us individually and collectively as a community. Yes. We are indeed grateful and we are proud of you. Thank you, Uncle. But something is still missing. Tide and time, they say wait for nobody. You are the only son of your parents. And they're not getting any younger. You and I discussed this thing some time ago. And you promised you're going to do something about it. But up till now, nothing has happened. Nothing. We are indeed very worried what is happening. Uh, Adelaide, Uncle, you know I lived in the city for a long time, before my retirement. Yes, I know, one may be carried away by the township or city life. Come to the village. Almost all the small, small boys in the community, they're all married with grown-up children, all of them. Think. You need to get a second wife that will bear you children. Um, well, Uncle, I want to start with thanking you for your concerns. And I know how you feel. I do. But um, the truth is that I cannot have two wives. It is against everything that I believe in and stand for. And speaking of my wife, Juliet, that woman and I have come a long way. We have been through thick and thin. That woman, for the sake of emphasis, has contributed to this success that you see today. Oh, Dili. Uncle. Your mother is no longer happy. She's a very sad woman as I speak. And we, at home, are the ones bearing the brunt of our present mood. Nobody is saying that you should live with two women in the same house. Just get a wife that will give you children, and she will stay with your mother at home. Simple. Mm -mm. Uncle, it's not simple. It's, it's not. I love my wife. Yes, very much. And like I said, we have been through thick and thin. We have been through a whole lot. And this is just a phase. And together we shall conquer this phase of our lives. Certainly. Uncle, I understand that you love your wife so much. I do. And we are not asking you to love her less. All we are asking you to do is the needful. Do the right thing. This matter, listen, this matter is as clear as the afternoons. You may be more, you may be richer and more educated than I am. But wisdom has nothing to do with education or riches. Look at uh, Professor Odenjo and Dr. Odenba. Are they not more educated than you are? But they had second wives. They forgot their Oyibo Oyibo why they were not able to give them children. And they married second wives that gave them children. My dear, I want you to be wise. 
They say in cause on a city. In Canada, they know not how to look at one. Why is think? It is fine, my uncles. Um, like you have requested, I will think, and I will. Uh, I will get back to you on this. Thank you very much. Let's drink, please. There's Take. no time, oh. <laughs> there is no time. <laughs> Mama? How are you? It's my day. I don't have other people. Say that again. Mama, this will be epic. In a quick. Hello, my dear. How are you? In a quick. If you're in front of you. Ah, no, this is good. Hey! Mama. Hey! Oberoma, mwa. Onyege, nyem. Oberoma, mwa. Onyege, nyem. Oberoma, mwa. Happy birthday in advance, mom. Thank you, my happy, darling. Happy birthday. We have... Your children will celebrate. Amen. Amen. Hey! Amen. Amen. Hey! Amen. Amen. <laughs> we have some things in the trunk, mom. Um, but... um, yes, if oh, we can just get up to get them. Hey! <laughs> hey! Oberoma, mwa. Onyege, nyem. Oberoma, mwa. Onyege, nyem. Oberoma, mwa. Cut her birthday cake. Yeah. So <clears throat> give me an M. Oh. An amazing A. Hey. A miraculous M. Oh. And another amazing A. Oh. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you.
church. Amen. We pray that you continue to live in good health. Amen. Amen. We wish long life. Amen. We wish that you continue to progress Amen. Amen. in all the things that you do. Amen. Amen. Look around, Mama. You see that what you have here are your close knitted family. We showed up here today to show you love. Oh my God. Exceedingly. May the good Lord continue to bless you, Mama. Amen. And we shall gather here again in years Amen. to come to celebrate you again. Amen. Amen. Happy birthday, Mama. Thank you, darling. We love you. Thank 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 you, everybody. Thank you. Oh, my darling. Thank you. Thank you. I noticed how you felt when they were snapping photograph. I understand it because... I was once in that situation. Yes. For two years, I did not conceive. And those two years were like 20 years today. Today, we are with your husband in the city. Nobody worries you. Or do I worry you? No, Mama. In my time, you wake up with somebody reminding you that you are a nuisance and you go to bed the same way. <laughs> my mother-in-law even got a girl for my husband, though he refused the girl entering the house. My mother-in-law kept her in her quarters and tried everything for my husband to impregnate her. It was at the peak of all this crisis that God answered me. Today, I'm a mother and a grandmother. Oh, Mama, I never knew about this. Your husband doesn't know either. Because I have every reason to thank God. So I don't dwell in the past. <laughs> the last time we spoke on this matter, you told me you have done several tests. Are they saying you cannot conceive? Um, no, Mama, no doctor has said that. They only said that um, I have nothing to worry about because there's nothing wrong with me. Then why haven't you conceived? Seven years is a long time for a woman. Seven years. I think it is time I play my role. Yes. I will take you to the man that helped me. Though he's late now, but his daughter inherited the medicine. So, you are going to stay back here. Okay? If your husband wants to stay with you, it's left for you people. Yes, um, the, the treatment will take one week. After which you become pregnant. Unless if you don't have a womb. Yes, one week you're pregnant. Uncle, please take it easy. What? Please take it easy. Is it is it painful? Yes, then you finish with this whole place and my whole body is paining me now. You turn it with my leg again. Look at Daniel. Was this supposed to be a, 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 a sweet? Are you not looking for a baby? Yes, I am, Bob. Am I your husband to, 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 to caress you and, 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 and papa you? So why are you harassing me? For doing my job? I'm sorry, please continue. Yeah. Listen to me. I inherited this job from my father. Do you hear me? But I do it better than my father. What I give are twins and triplets. Because I'm doing it in a more modern European way. You understand? My father was doing it in a very kaik way. I'm doing it in a very one way. Why don't you say twins and triplets? Don't you want twins? Don't you want to have I, twins? I want twins. Relax. Yeah, yeah. I also help uh, uh, women whose husbands are not uh, capable. You understand? So, in case you need such uh, assistance, 
Please, can we concentrate on what you were doing? Meaning, meaning that I am not concentrating? No, I know you are concentrating, but you, you don't want leg. Can you do the other thing? You think all those women have twins and triplets just like that? I don't know where, where this woman brought, 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 brought you from. All these, all these uh, city people just come here between selling, 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 selling. You think it's by gentle, 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 they get twins and, uh, and, and, and triplets. Because there's a more good place. I think you're like, well. You're going to carry this one uh, uh, to their break before you wash. Do you understand that? Yes. Till their break. Now this. The white one on your skin is black one inside your body. Okay. When the black one goes inside, it will wash your, the inside of your body and it will become like white. You understand it? Good. You are going to take this one for seven days. You use it to drink, pap, akam. When you do your akam, you pour it, turn it, and drink it. Finish it for seven days. After seven days, guaranteed, you have a baby. Okay. So I hope you know how to do, do akam. Yes. Okay. Okay. This one, when should I take it? Morning or night? What time do people do things that will bring a baby? So, at night. Question, Adjujo. If it's in the after hot afternoon that you and your husband will do something to have a baby, no problem. But take it for seven days okay. and everything will be fine. Okay. Eh? Uh -huh. What quantity? Uh, uh, I'm through with you. Uh, if if he, if you want, <laughs> yes, yes, I'm busy. I'm busy. Go on, go on. I'm busy. Uh, Madam, I'm through with you. Greet your mother-in-law for me. Eh? Uh, 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 if he, uh, okay, how is the baby? <laughs> it is God the Lord's doing.
Are you okay? Eh? Do you need me? Did I come in? Huh? Welcome here. Yeah. Thank you. Get this. Okay. Yeah, it's, uh, Mama is here. 
Mama is here. Yes. Um, she came about one hour ago. Eh. Yes, yes. She's, where is she? Yeah, she's in the sitting room. Did you offer her anything? Yeah, I gave her a bottle of more drink. Okay, get those things ready in the kitchen so I can make a quick meal for her to eat. Okay, Let me have on. my bath. All right, all right. With a lot of spice, Mom, how did you Mama, cope with it? Mama did not ask you if it was with a lot of spice or not. She just said she enjoyed it. I didn't come all the way here to eat, though I enjoyed the food. Oh, you know why I'm here. Hmm? I've waited for two months. It doesn't take two months for a woman to know her condition. So, how far? Uh, Mama, I was actually going to come and see you over the weekend to um see i am here now that thing you wanted to come and tell me say it now i'm here um, mama concerning the treatment it's, the... it's, it's fine uh mom let me be honest with you that treatment didn't work huh? Yes, mom. It almost killed my wife. And from the moment she took that concussion, she started purging. She pushed to a point where she almost collapsed and I had to drive her to the hospital myself, mom, where she stayed for two days just to recuperate. Look, mom, I understand where you're going with this and we appreciate it. But it's just not working. And mom, if you ask me, I, I, I think that, you know, this outdated con con concussion is, is, is not healthy for a woman like my wife. It almost killed her. So this is the story you and your wife cooked up to tell me? We do. I'm not cooking up a story. I'm, I'm telling you what actually happened. I knew it would come to this. I knew it. Everybody said it. But I said, no, let me be sure before I join in crucifying her. Now I know. I've confirmed it. She's using charm on you. Don't, don't say things like that. Shut up! I don't like it. Oh, now. shut up, you foolish boy. What do you know? What do you know? What did Why do you have you refused to give me a grandchild? Eh? Why? Why can't you take a second wife? Since this one cannot come. I'm not taking a second wife. My, yes, my father was not polygamous. He didn't. He, he oh, didn't, shut he up! Have two wives. Shut I up! I won't, I won't do it. Shut up. My wife is going to bear children when it's time for her to bear children. Oh, Dilly, please just calm down, okay? Please. How long have I been waiting? Eh, oh, Dilly? Anyway. As for you, I treated you like my own daughter. But what did you do? But you chose to treat me like a nobody. I, I left everything I was doing to arrange for your treatment for you to conceive like every other woman. Hey, shut up! What did you do? You threw away my medicine only for you to cook up a cock and bull story for me? But let me tell you, some medicines have more potency than others. You watch out. As for you, Odile, <laughs> you used to obey me as a mother, but not anymore. I am now a bushwoman that will prepare medicine that will kill your wife, your beloved wife. Oh. Odile, what has this woman done to you? What kind of soup has she cooked for you, Odile? Oh. Conceive 
this is your husband. The same medicine. Why are you bothered? You think I would suddenly stop having faith in what we share and leave you halfway? Or you think I'm going to stop loving you because of our present circumstances? on this matter. No one has the ability to influence my thoughts towards you, my wife. Not my sister, Maka. Not even Mama. Okay? You're mine, you're my wife, and I love you with all of my heart, and I need you to take your head out of these petty temptations. It will pass. It will go, I promise you. Don't worry yourself. Okay? Listen, I, I want you and I to get away from all of this tension and, you know, go on a two-week vacation in London. And luckily, I was able to trace an old friend who is, um, who is now a gynecologist, and he's promised me that he's going, to, he's going to offer us the best in terms of medical care. And I am positive that by the time we come back, things will change for good, sweetheart. I love you with all of my heart and I am dedicated to spending my life proving that to you. Yes. Fine. Okay. Going to church can't talk. Oh, now you remember. Yes. It's a Sunday. Call me tomorrow. Bye. Why are you calling me at this time? Yeah, I made it clear. I said, do not call me after office hours. Listen, man, listen, listen to me. Listen to me. If you cannot call me within office hours, then don't call me. Forget it. All right? Don't call me. Yeah. Show up tomorrow at the office. And then come state your case. Let's, let's, 
Analyze it again before we take further action. All right? So you need to calm down and understand how you feel. See you then. Bye. Why are you yelling on the phone? I don't mind this man. I don't know what his problem is. He's constantly calling me and bothering me. Ma'am, I thought I heard the lady's voice. Forgive me, please. It's a woman, actually, you know. You know those clients who can't even afford to pay your professional fee? They just have one problem or the other at every point. You know? I see. Just don't let them bother you. Thanks, love. Thank you. Mm. Yeah. Uh, would you like something to drink? Oh, yeah. I would love to drink something right now. Yeah, please. Juice? Anything. Anything. All right, I'll go. Something. Please. Yeah. Get from the fridge. Thanks. Thanks. Probably what's wrong? Hmm? You're not eating, don't you like the food? Um, food is good. Food is, is good. So? I don't know, I think I'm... Um, I'm having malaria symptoms and it's just affecting, you know. Malaria? Yeah. You treated malaria last week. Yeah, that's true. I, yeah. Probably I didn't treat it throughout through, you know, how those things can be, it just keeps going and coming, you know. Plus I've been doing a lot lately, you know, work pressure, running around. Yes. So, yeah, sometimes it just gets to you. I think you should see Dr. Kafo, perhaps run some tests and know what exactly is wrong. Wow, that's a good idea, but um, don't you think we should just give this a few days and see how I, how I carry on? Because I just might be able to shake it off, you know, you never know. But I think I'll be fine. Okay? I'm positive that I'll... I should be fine. Hmm? Can you give me a moment, please? I'll be back. Is everything all right? Um, yeah, everything is fine, you know. It's Amaka on the phone, you know. You know how she can be, throwing tantrums and all. I'm just, you know, what... And so what's the problem this time around? You know how this people can be, you know, how Juliet did this, Juliet, that, Juliet. Everything is fine, I have it under control, okay? Odile, everything is not fine. You have been detached lately, acting strangely. What is going on? Look at you, you've lost so much weight. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. Come on, I'm fine. Look at me, I'm fine. What, you don't trust me anymore? I'm fine. I'm not talking about trust. I, I'm just worried. Oh, okay. Maybe I worried so much, but I'm... Yes, baby. You worried so much. I'm fine. Please okay. talk to me. What's the matter? There's no problem. I'm fine. You hear? Fine. Look, darling, I want you to know that I love you. Okay? I love you so much. Nothing anyone will do. Okay? There will be challenges. They will try. The world will try to put us apart, children. But I need you to look at me. 
my love for you will never fail. Because I love you unconditionally. Okay. No, you're confusing me. You need to talk to me. What the problem? Tell me what the problem is, please. What's the problem? Huh? I am fine. I know you're fine, but you still need to tell me what the problem is. You've just been... There is no problem. You sure? Yeah, I have it under control. <laughs> I have a marker under control. <laughs> They're trying to bother my wife for me, but hey. What are you doing inside? I was cleaning the dishes in the kitchen. Mm. What is it? What's the matter? There's a woman inside and she came with lots of bags. It seems she has come to live with us. A woman inside? Yes, ma. Who is she looking for? Oga. Did she say what her name is? No, ma. She didn't say what her name is and you let her into the house? I'm sorry, ma. What do you know what to do? Please, go, go, go. Do you know what? Just go to the back. I don't want to see you. Afternoon. Yeah, um, I am Mrs. Madoka. I understand you're here to see my husband. I am Mrs. Madoka too. I am pregnant for orderly, and I've come here to take my rightful position in this house. <clears throat> um, I, I there's, there's a mistake somewhere because, like I said earlier, I am Mrs. Madoka, and my husband obviously is Mr. Madoka. So I'm sure you have the wrong address. Do not be silly. Like I said, I am carrying Odile's child and I know exactly who I'm talking about. And I'm carrying his baby. Are you not his barren wife? Are you not? Are you moping at me? Well, the truth is that I cannot be living out there with my unborn child whilst you enjoy in here all by yourself. It is not done. Not possible. Ooh, there has to be a mistake. There's a mistake. Trust me, there is a mistake. Yes. Obviously. The only mistake is that you have refused to understand your present status in this house. And the earlier you understand it, the better for you. Please call the maids. My bags needs to get inside the room. Thank you. I am ruined. I'm completely ruined. For a very long time, I've suspected something was wrong. My husband started to act like a stranger in the house. He kept assuring me that everything was okay. It's okay. 
of temptation is this? Can this be true? I will never, I will never forgive Odile for this humiliation. I will just, I will just pack and leave the house if this is true. And that's exactly what that stupid woman would want you to do. But Julie, you would do no such thing. You can leave all your toy for behind for one imposter to come into your house and rip where she did not sow. Never. Where is Dordie? I don't know. I don't know where my husband is, Joma. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Calm down. Mm? Please. I do advise you go back to your house. Yes. Don't let this woman know that you are worried by her presence. Treat her like a visitor. If she becomes nasty, ignore her until your husband returns. Please. What am I going to do? Oh, come what on. am I going to do, Joe? What it's will okay. I do? It's okay. Stop this crying. Stop. Stop. And one more thing. You need to put up a fight. Just be ready. You need to put up a fight for your right. Okay. In case if this is true. Okay. Come. Come. Okay. Okay. How can you keep me out for so long when you know that I'm carrying your child? Your first pregnancy for that matter. You were supposed to get me a flat and a car to go with it. But you didn't do that. You were busy giving me flimsy excuses. Now give me 20 million naira to better my life because I know you have the money. You wouldn't do that. You're costing me up and down. What kind of a man are you? Not charm, not just charm. I don't know what you they talk, oh. Me, I have come to stay. This is also my husband's house. The one where they even mad me be say, my co-wife will sit down for here, no fee give me water or food to eat as I did here since. So stop it! Stop talking. What the hell is wrong with you? How dare you barge into my house like this? I should be asking you that question, Odili. How dare you keep me out for so long? Your pregnant wife! What's the apple? Better show me where to keep my bags. What am I going to do? Mike, you have ruined me. Mike, you have... Mike, see what you cost. I shouldn't have just indulged in the first place. What am I going to do now? Huh? This... Huh? My... After all, no one will come out of it alive. My father says so. Your father says so? Yes. <laughs> he says so many crazy things about marriage. He said, without a mistress outside, 
Marriage is too boring. Me, my friend, Odi. Odi. My good friend. Okay, fine. Cheese. Oh, oh, okay. Don't go away. Hi, Odi. Hi. I'm hi. Carol. I'm Odi. My friends call me Odi. Yeah, that's very nice. Thank you. Hi. Oh, no, come on. Let's not. Uh, don't do that. No. I am the lady here, and it doesn't matter. Come on. Please. When you like something, you go for it. Yeah. You like me? Mike. <laughs> it is my father's revelation. Mike. <laughs> it is my father's revelation. Mike. <laughs> Bye. Getting pregnant for me is not part of the value. All right, you made it clear that, 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 that you have some needs, and of course I provided for you the times that you were with me. You, I gave you money for everything that you wanted at the time. Why are you calling to tell me this now? I called to know how you're doing. Please don't leave me, please. Please. 
I'll be ruined without you, please. Look, I understand how you feel. I know you're devastated right now, but please, once you calm down, I'll explain things to you. Please, please don't leave me. I beg you, please, it doesn't have to be this way. What do you mean? Stay away from me. Okay. All right, fine, I'll do that, all right? I, you don't want me around. I, I can get my things. I can move to the spare room. I can, I can leave you by yourself here, but please, just don't leave me. Please. I beg you, please. All right, I'm stepping out. I'm, I'm, I'm stepping out, please. I'm stepping out, please. understand how painful this can be. My people say no matter how bad the thing is, you can't take the eyes off it. We've been part of this family for so long. We feel and understand your pains. Your husband is so sorry about the turn of events. He never meant to disgrace or humiliate you. Thank you. So hard. I'm sorry. I really am sorry. I am sorry. I know that you're hurt. I know how you feel. I know that I have betrayed our love and everything that you and I have shared. All of this time, but I am deeply sorry. I don't want to lose you. Please, love. Whatever you do, please don't, don't, don't go away. Don't, don't leave me. Go, please, I beg you. I don't even know what happened. I, This is not me. All right, it was it was just a stupid fling that, that happened a long time ago. I, I totally forgot about it, and, and then the girl just resurfaced from nowhere. I'm ashamed of what I've done to you, Juliet. Because, well, I'm, I'm sorry. God sees my heart. I am deeply sorry. Please don't don't, don't leave. Please, you know this is not me. I would suggest in the interim you will find a house for this woman in town. Of course she cannot be here. She can't stay here with us. I'll, I'll get a place for her to, 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 to stay. Julie, we all know that you're a wonderful woman. I beg you, find a place in your heart to forgive him. Your husband needs you at this moment. <sighs> I... I just wish someone would just... wake me up and tell me it's been a dream that this isn't happening because I am finding it really hard to believe that my husband of so many years can just be involved in such a mess. The other leader I married God knows how long. 
can do this to me after all these years. He, I, I could have sworn with my life that he can never be involved in this kind of... If, even if he wanted a second wife, even if he wanted a child, he should have come to me. There is nothing. There is nothing he will ask of me that I, can, I would say no to ever. He didn't say anything to me. He just decided to humiliate and embarrass me this way by bringing that girl. I just, I just wish someone would just wake me up and tell me it's been a dream. And tell me, Julie, this is all a dream. They, I should just wake up. <sighs> told you earlier, don't let this woman win this. Don't. She's already winning. Don't make her I'm effect. not pregnant. Am I? Am oh, I? Stop talking I, nonsense. <laughs> Have you forgotten what happened to Jizoma? The same thing happened to her. And God eventually gave her her own children. And the whole story changed. When my story At changed. God's when, own appointed when will time. God answer me? Well, Have you forgotten uh, uh, of Sarah in the Bible? Oh, I can't believe it. Where is your faith? This is a delicate situation. I know. Maybe I will advise. I know you need the baby. And as well, you need your wife. Of course I do, Dave, I do. This is why you you have to apply wisdom. Huh? You see, you have to manage this lady. Within the period, she will deliver your baby. Okay. So, she won't upset your home front. Alright? You need to be strong. We're men. We're men. I, I, I know you need a baby of your own. I honestly do, Dave. Thank you so very much. Thank you. Please. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks a lot, man. Um. <laughs> Remember what the Bible says. Whatever he hears us say, he will do for us. Where is your faith? The faith you built this marriage on. I can't, I can't, I can't. I've told you, don't let this woman have everything. Why you lose everything? It's so easy for you to say because you have your own children. I understand. Stop this. Come on, stop. Welcome. Thank you. How are you? I am where you left me. Yes. Ever since.
since I came to this house, Odile, you have never taken me out for once. Odile, you're not romantic at all. At all! Um, look, I, um, I got in touch with my agent today and we were able to get a two-bedroom apartment somewhere on the mainland. So I think you would need to pack your things and eh? move there. Eh? Mengini? Esu? Somewhere you can stay. Mwah! Karo! Mainland! So you want me to go and live at the mainland while you live on the island? Oh, are you not ashamed of yourself? Are you not ashamed of yourself to tell the mother of your child to go and live on the mainland. Nageto, why is you live in this beautiful mansion with that, that useless wife of yours? Eh? If you're not there, Maggie, are you not ashamed? It will not work for you. It will not work for you at all. What nonsense? Eh? What did you just say? Who did you say is useless? Well, I don't have water in my mouth when I'm talking. I said that you are useless. Who else is useless in this house apart from you? Are you not useless? You call me useless. Very useless. Ah! Ah! Stop. You want to keep ranting? I need to fix your madness once and for all. It is you and your entire generation that are really mad. You are mad. I know what you want to do. I know exactly what you want to do. You want me to fight you. So you can have the opportunity to kill my unborn baby. The baby you could not have all these years. Hey, hey, hey. You have failed. You have failed woefully. Carol, enough. All right? Which? Enough! Stop! Get your things together. All right? And leave the house. I've got you in your place. Just get your things and leave. It's the one way. It's the Fialo. And don't even shout at me, oh! I'm up on your hour. So wait, 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 see! If you're trying to intimidate me by leaving this house, you, it will never work for you. You have failed because I came fully prepared. You go, to go. Hey, my mola. Hey, 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 hmm. Oh, really? You. You are trying to impress her in my presence. Then at night, you will crawl like the snake you are into my room by midnight. And you will be begging for my kutus. I will so deal with you. You will come again, oh. I will so deal with you. You don't know me, Carol. You do not know me. And as for you, barren witch, you had the nerves to raise that filthy hands of yours and slap me. Okay, you have slapped me today, but I promise you one thing, my baby, my baby will give it to you back double when the time comes. I promise you that. Agadiewu. Um, there is something I would want to discuss with you. Huh. Go ahead. Well, the truth is that I'm tired. 
I am tired of living like a fugitive in this house. You don't show me love. You don't care for me anymore. The mother of your unborn child. I don't get it. If you do not want me in your house anymore, why don't you say it to my face? Say it to me and I will pack my things and go peacefully. But I'll show you one thing, Odili. If I leave this house, you will look for me. It's a promise. Um, do you realize that you have not said anything? Okay. My people are angry. Especially my uncle that threatened me here in Lagos. They are very angry. He said you will have to come and marry me normally. Then I can be able to live with you in your no, house. No, 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 yes, stop, stop it. You lie. Go back and tell your uncles that I will do no such thing. Hmm? Look at you. I can't marry you. I am married. I'm happily married. All right? So get that into your head. It's not going to happen. Very good. I also want you to get it into your own head that if you do not marry me, you will never have access to this baby. You won't. <laughs> You're suffering from ignorance. Because the law clearly states that a man who has fathered a child can lay claim to that child, whatever he chooses. And that is my position on this matter. <laughs> Look at this man. Oh. You are bringing your law into this. For my own picking, where I go carry nine months, burn them. Now you carry law, enter for me. <laughs> you know they fear? Well, when we get to the bridge, we will cross it. When the time comes, you will look for your law. Brother, you know go find them. I don't tell you. Harold, are you, are you threatening me? I'm talking to you. Are I am you? not threatening you. I'm stating the fact. It is obvious that you need help. Yes. See, brother, make you sure understand me. Understand with me. If your arrogance will allow you, come to my people and do the formal introduction. Make me your wife because I deserve to be one. As a matter of fact, I'm carrying your baby. So what? Do what you're supposed to do so that there won't be issue when this baby is born. I am saying it though. Hmm. You might think I'm being stupid with what I'm saying. But do not blame me when I hand this baby over to another man. Yes, I will do it though. You don't know me. I decrease. I have said it and that is how it will be. Emarasu is so unique. Emarasu is so nana. Okay. How did I get here? I single-handedly invited the devil into my home. How, how did I get here?
What? Why is there a problem? What sort of question is that? Why are you here? I didn't invite you. What are you doing here? Adelie, come on. I am your legally married wife. And I'm carrying your child. Have you suddenly forgotten? You shouldn't treat me like trash. This is your first child. This child needs your love, your warmth, your care, your love. Everything I can get from you, I need it now. You know, come on baby. Have you suddenly forgotten how it used to be? Look. Just, just feel, feel, just feel the baby. Oh my goodness. Can't you see the baby is moving? The baby knows you. The baby knows you are the father. I miss you. I miss, I miss us. Now, oh, babe, it's your turn to give me massage tonight. Hey, Mama. <laughs> Mama, welcome. No, mm -hmm. no, welcome. Mm -hmm. How was your journey here? Fine. Eh? How's everyone at home? I hope they're okay. Yes. They're fine. Yes. <sighs> Where is my son, Odile? Mama, he's not back from work, but he will soon be back. Um, do I get you something to eat? Maybe something. If you like, you get me something to eat. If you like, leave it. Oh. Okay, let me get to the kitchen. If we fall, you know, no, no, if you are okay. Why, no, 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 Yes, my dear. Thank you. Mama, I hope you enjoyed your meal. Yes. Yeah? Mm. I made it specially for you. <laughs> Do you want more water? I'm okay. Do you want any other thing? A drink? Or fruits? I'm okay. Okay. Don't worry. Your delay will soon be back, oh? Mm. Mm. This must be my new wife. And you must be my beautiful mother-in-law. Oh, <laughs> you're welcome, my dear. Thank you very much, Mama. How was your journey? Fine. Welcome. <laughs> it's true. You're already pregnant. Yes, Mama. <laughs> I am already pregnant. You are pregnant. Yes, oh. I am. Eh! 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 Is the girl pregnant? Yes, mom. Hey, hey, hey. Is it? Or the one easy? It's not easy. Or this is the pregnant. It's not easy. Mama, <laughs> <laughs> well, don't worry yourself. I'm going to give your son a bouncing baby boy. Mama, ah, I know it's a boy, and it's going to look exactly like my son. Oh, or the really? Ow! Oh. <laughs> hey. Excuse me, mama. <laughs> Hey! me. Oh! Many horses on one. I'm a man, I'm a man. I hope you have something to eat. I've eaten. Mama, it's not easy. Pregnancy is not an easy thing. It's not easy. Or can chevelo. Or can I said the pink slippers. Are you dying? Bring the one she wants now. What is wrong with this foolish girl? I'm a man. I'm a man. This is 
is how she behaves. This is how she behaves. Every time I say that to do something for me, she will just be misbehaving. Don't yes. worry. Very soon, I will put you in your place in this house. Mom, mom, mom. Don't let anybody stress you in this house. This is your house. Mama, nobody feeds you that kind of thing. Uh -huh. Nobody. Uh -huh. I never born there. Uh -huh. ah. <laughs> Stop it, Carol. Stop it. Stop it. You didn't tell her you wanted the pink slippers. And you didn't have to hit her. I will Don't hit her. her. I will hit her because this Don't is my stress. house. Don't stress. Eh? Biko, 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 Biko. Bia, it's not again. Mama. Bia, do let go. You can't have all it. Biko, eh, 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 eh. Biko, Biko. What the good nature? Mama, leave her. I know what's wrong with her. You know she has been barren for over how many years? Ota. Eh, eh. Ota. So what I got in one month, she was not able to get in seven years. Oh, the police. So now, oh, 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 You have now known that you have been waiting in vain and you have done what you're supposed to do as a man. I mean, her medicine has lost potency and suddenly your eyes open and you shut. <laughs> well, Mama, I don't know what you're talking about. There is no one here who I know who happens to be diabolic. Oh, Zwai, you wouldn't know. You wouldn't know because you are the victim. But the most important thing is that you have done what you're supposed to do. <laughs> oh, where, is, where is my wife? Eh? Juliet. Eh, eh. She should be in the room. What else? Oh, Gana, Larodola, she's sleeping. We have. Hey! Um, can you see? He's after Juliet. He doesn't even care about his pregnant wife. Don't worry. You are pregnant. And I'm here. I will change things. Don't worry. I believe you, Mama. Ah, don't worry. I believe you. <laughs> don't worry. She'll soon be here. Okay, thank you, darling. Last <laughs> uh, Very good. What are you still standing here doing? Sorry. Won't you go? Gossip. You are listening to the one you go and tell your useless sister. Leave that one now. What? Stupid idiot. <laughs> My dear, which one would you like? Uh uh. Both of them, thank you. Uh. Ah. <laughs> hey, <laughs> sweetheart. You're welcome. My friend here, Biola, has been waiting for you. She used to be my mother's very close friend when she was alive. As a matter of fact, we lived in the same yard together. Yes, I gave you. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> My pleasure, sir. Thank you, madam. Yes. You're welcome. Thank you very much, yes, sir. Ah, oh, sir, I'm sure you don't know I've been to this, your house, many times. Oh, you have? Yes, yes, yes. Juliet, your wife and I, we are schoolmates back. In fact, best friends in school, eh? Then we lost contact, we reconnected, and suddenly, she banned me from coming to your house. In fact, she chased me out like a criminal. Why would my wife do that to you? <laughs> Simply because I told her the truth. You cannot hold a man down forever. Mm -hmm. When you know you're not capable, you cannot be a dog in a manger. That's wicked. You cannot be a dog in a manger. <laughs> but nice. sir, you know what they say? Karma, they say, is a bitch. You know? So, one good turn this afternoon. Today, it's my friend's day. <laughs> yes, so, ah, 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 you do my friend. Ah, hey, don't be so.
surprise. Don't, 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 don't. I will come to visit you, my dear. Friendship with me. Ah, don't worry. I'm sure you're surprised of seeing me. No, 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 no. I didn't come to see you. I came to see my friend, your co-wife. Yes, with this special invitation. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. That's it. Oh, you know what? It, it's fine. You don't have to dig up your calls. No, 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 sir. Don't say that. Sir, you need to see what this let your wife and her friend, that boot-licking chum of, that mug that, that, that rapes people of millions coming, did to me. They treated me like a crab, a, a, a criminal, come on, one in the street. Stop. It's okay, madam. I said it's enough. You're embarrassing my wife. And as a matter of fact, I think it is late. Pick your bag. Oh, do you know? No, you what? will not insult my friend. No, no. what? What are you? What? You will join your friend. No, I, I will not. Don't, don't do that. Out. You're not sending my friend out. Eh? Why are you embarrassing my friend and sending her out? What has she done to you? I don't like this, oh. I don't like this. You can join her if you want. Join her to where? This house is mine. I'm the full owner of this house. Jesus! Jesus! Ah! Hey! Ah! Huh? Jesus! Are you okay? Ah! Hey, 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 hey. Help! Hey, 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 hey. What is, what is, what is it? My stomach is on fire! Calm down, calm down. It's on fire! Oh. Hey! What, what did you eat? What, what? Poison! They are poisoning my food! What? Oh, poison! Oh. Poison? From where? How? What are you talking about? I saw it. I saw it when she was putting it, but I thought. I thought it was salt. You saw who? You saw what? When? Ah! ah! Hey, hey! Oh! Salt, salt, salt. Hold me, take it. I saw her. She poisoned my food, but I. You saw who? When? What are you saying? I saw it. I mean, I saw her putting it, but I thought it was salt. Slow down, slow down. Just, just slow down. Ah! Shh, it's okay. Just breathe. Breathe. Salt, salt, salt. She. Your jealous wife. What is it, my food? You want to kill me, my unborn baby? You want to do that? Ah! I feel like I'm going to kill you. Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! 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 Did you do it? Are you serious? Are you... Are you honestly asking me that question? Remnant of that outspit, just to prove my innocence. What do you mean? You are no longer the man I married. Oh, 
God, oh. I have vomited the poison finally. How? No weapon fashion or formed against me shall prosper. I am serving a living God indeed. stay here. You can see how everything has turned out to be. No, I can't stay here alone. She will kill me. I she, can't stay here. She will not kill you. Please. If you leave, my husband will suffer. Please. Stay. You know he's the one that brought you here. Okay, um, I left my purse upstairs on the table. Please help me get it. This. I can't stay here. I can't stay here. Please, let me meet you. Please, my husband will suffer if you. Please. <laughs> I can't stay here alone. Please, let me go with you. Please, thank you. Please. Please, please, let me go with you. How's your day? Fine. I missed you. Did you miss me? Um, where's Comfort? I need help yeah, with a few things. What? They are gone. Gone? Gone? What? Where? They? Who, who are they? Who else but your witch of a wife? She left with Comfort earlier today. I serve a living God. And he has fought my battle. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? She le left my house? Do I have water in my mouth? She picked her miserable belongings and left us. Isn't that good? Good riddance to bad rubbish. And I think we should be fine. Good riddance to bad rubbish. My goodness. <laughs> What is this for? Look at it now. Take a look first. That is the list of what I need to start up a business. Cosmetic business to be precise. Just 15 million naira. 15 million? Mm -hmm. You and I ever talked about this before? But we're talking about it now. See, the truth is, I am tired of staying in this house doing nothing and taking this small, small change you give to me when you want to. 
I need to start up my own business. Carol, your condition right now is very delicate. You can't possibly be getting what? into anything stressful. What condition are you talking about? Did I tell you that I'm sick? Please, I'm perfectly fine. I have told you times with that number. Give me the business Juliet abandoned and left this house. No, you will not. Give me money to start up my own business. Mba. What kind of a man are you? Okay, I don't have 15 million. That's fine now. I don't, I don't have. You must have it, oh. You must have that 15 million naira. What are you talking about? If it is Juliet now, you write check fast, fast. You're telling me you don't have money. See, if you don't give me this money, I'm asking you of. I will go out there and meet men that will give me the money and I can give them my baby. Are you threatening me? Sherbeti. What? Do you, are you, you want to trade with, 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 my, with my child? What child? Your child, my foot. See, if you don't cooperate with me, you will not just like me. Ah. You know what? Stop ranting and just get out of my face. Get off my face! Evil woman. Eh? It is you. Your mama, your papa, your entire family now be evil. You are evil. Who you call evil? Did you just insult my mother? You heard me. Did you just insult my mother? You heard me. You just. You want beat me? <laughs> you want beat me? You want me? You want me to lose this baby? Did, did you just call beat me? Beat me. Oh, did beat me? Ah, beat me make I lose this baby. No, no, no. Make I just push him for you now. Beat me. Are you looking? You don't want to beat me again. Beat me now. Beat me. If I want to beat me, give me ordinary 50 million. You will not. If they see me even walking, I'm going to walk out for me. But you will not bring money. You want to beat me again? <laughs> I am very ready for you. Beat me. You know what I mean? I am not Juliet, though. I am not Ice Walk. Don't try me for this house. You must give me that money whether you like it or not. Mm -hmm. It's good you're here. Um, I need you to take me to the hospital tomorrow. I need to start my antenatal. My baby is growing every day. As much as that is not a bad thing to do, um, I'll be here tomorrow. I'll be traveling to England tomorrow. Huh? Yes, I'll be away on a short vacation um, for two weeks. Um, so I'm hoping that um, you take care of this place while I'm away and not burn it down. I don't understand you. You are traveling to America tomorrow and you're just telling me now. Caroline, I'm traveling to England now, London to be precise, not America. And if I had told you last week, what would you have done differently? Am I not good enough? Am I not good enough to travel with you to the England? Am I not? Eh? I transferred some money to you. I'm, I'm sure you got the alert this morning. I'm hoping that that is enough to take care of your needs while I'm not here. Your mother said it. And she's correct, 100%. Juliet bewitched you. Ever since she left this house, you have become like a stray dog. You have never sat down for once, even if for a minute, with the woman that is carrying your child. Now you want to run off to London. Agalacha must come back. Do you understand? And I want you to understand that. I must have this baby of mine in that London, whether that your witch of a wife likes it or not. If you like, when you get there, you make the arrangements. If you like, don't. You know me now. I know what to do. I know exactly what to do. In a gym gland. Also, also video will below you. What's this? Please, Choma, I beg you, I beg you with everything you hold so dear. Audley must never find out where I am. 
Please, I don't ever want to see him again. I don't want to have anything to do with him. Just don't tell him who I am, please. All right? All right, I'll talk to you later. Bye. On this trip, I ran into someone who told me a lot about you. How you schemed for this prostitute here uh, uh, uh. to come into my home. Me? <laughs> no, 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 no. It, it's not possible now. How you planned to take everything that my wife and I had worked so hard for when the both of you eliminated us? No, now. Ejiro cannot tell you that kind of lie. Oh, so you know who told me? <laughs> Without mentioning her name, you know who told me? <laughs> See how shaken you are, you know why? Because the guilty are afraid. You know right now I could get both of you arrested for this fraud and conspiracy, but I'm not going to waste my time on two refraps like both of you. I'm going to go upstairs and by the time I come back here, I want the both of you out of my house in 10 minutes. Uh, baby, uh, <clears throat> baby, uh, 10. Minutes. Out of my house. Um, uh, baby, please don't do this. I still love you. This baby is yours and... You can ship this child to another man like you have constantly threatened to do. It, it, it wasn't... Um, I, I never meant it, Miko. The baby is yours. Carol, if I come downstairs again and I find you and this idiot here... I will have the both of you arrested. Hi. Get out of my house. Oh, come see This minute. Okay. Oh, come see Joe. Out! Ah! <laughs> see you, as big as you are, that is how big your foolishness is. So what we discuss secretly, that is what you went to do and go with. Hey, shut up. Ah! Shut down your mouth. Shut down your shameless man. See this in this lazy bamboo. You cannot even work hard and collect good money for me to open shop in Idumata. You're here making yeah. Idumata kill you. Eh? Money kill you there. Are you not stupid? So the money I made, I should give it to you. What is wrong with your own? What is wrong with your own? Shut, 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 shut it, shut it. Make money with your own. I don't have time. It's I don't have me. time, then unfortunately for you. Uh, you never finish. Uh, uh, in this matter, I never finish. Well, I don't have time for rotten tomato like you. Who will rotten tomato? Where you want us to go? I, well, you never help me pack my teeth. I want to go home. Which home? You get home. Uh, you don't let me pack my teeth. No, it's not possible. Wait, see. Carry your load for your head. That's all. You know? Have fun. Bye. Yes. Don't go punish you. Hello, Choma. Choma, please, I am begging you, stop this. Why? Why are you doing this to me? I begged you. You promised me, you promised to, to be in this with me. You promised to help me recover and get back on my feet and move on with my life. Chama, please, I don't want. I don't want to see him. The doctor said I don't need to stress myself anymore. Why are you doing this to me? Do you want me to die? No. I am not going to listen to you. Just don't tell Odili where I am. That's it. 
I won't listen to you, Choma. I won't. Don't tell him where I am. Thank you. Oh, the least desperate to see you. Please. There's something going on, Please. Julie. Please, Choma, do not get on my nerves. How do you expect me to go back to live with that thing? That dread of a human. After all the humiliation, the embarrassment, the, the disgrace. Okay? Is that how you forget? What is wrong with you? Look, I don't want to hear anything that has to do with orderly or whoever. Simple. Carol is no longer in the house. So? Orderly threw her out. Uh -huh. What happened? Honestly, I have no idea. Honestly, I don't know. But I heard that we were partying in the house. Carol and your friend were partying in the house when Orderly came in and threw them out. Julie, I also heard that your so-called friend, Viola, has been behind this whole plot. Viola? How? Audley will tell you that when you see him. Julie, I have been with you every step of the way. I cannot deceive you. Your husband is genuinely repentant. And you have to see him. Please. Time heals all wounds. Yes. Time, they say, heals all wounds. But the scars will always remain. This scar will remain. <sighs> yeah, I know. But the scars never hurt anymore. And we rarely remember how we got them. Please. I've come to ask you to please. Find it in your heart to forgive me. I'm sorry. Believe me, I know how you feel. I'm ashamed of myself, Juliet. But I've come here hoping that the love will be altered, the times we spent together will count for something. I've come here hoping that you find it in your heart, because I know you have a good heart. I've come here to ask that you find it in your heart to forgive this man who does not know how to live without you anymore. Juliet, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I saw what you went through. First hand, I saw you put yourself through very difficult situations, exposed yourself to danger just because you wanted to give me a child. I'm sorry. Juliet, all this time, I have been responsible for our childlessness. Yes. I ran into my gynecologist friend, the one that I told you, lives in London, and a series of tests were conducted on me, and the results showed that I have a medical condition that would not necessary allow me at a time like this to father a child. Um, Chilat, I panicked. I panicked because I... I want to be a father. I honestly want to have a child of my own. But he told me that I'll be fine. that I need a minor surgery, and after that, I'll be fine. But I don't want to be fine without you. Sweetheart, I want to be fine with you. Please, forgive me. What about Carol? What about her pregnancy? 
It's not mine. She admitted to it before she left. Okay. Yeah. What about Irene D? The lady you said got pregnant for you and went back in school before we started dating. What about her? Um, that pregnancy isn't mine either. Um, it wasn't mine. I, because the test also showed that I have been this way from birth. So there's no way I could have been able to father a child with anyone unless it is corrected through proper surgery. So, for seven years, for seven years, I thought it was my fault. Okay, this is a long, bad dream. It's a bad dream that could end well with you. Don't know where to start. Please forgive me. Seven years. At least seven years. Please forgive me. Please wait, forgive wait, me. Wait. Please. It's not my fault. No, it's not. <gasps> it's not your fault, baby. It's not your fault. <laughs> it's never died. been your fault. I know. I am sorry. Please. <laughs> Please, 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 please. So, are you going to be okay? It is you're going to be okay. Yeah, look, I don't, I don't, I don't know if I believe whatever the doctors have said, but I believe that if you travel with me and be by my side for this surgery, I will be fine. <laughs> That's how much faith I have in our love, baby. Father, we realize, and yes, I'm knowing it's true. Ain't no one ever do me like you. I know people, somebody who can treat me like you. Girl, I want that. Ooh. Oh, baby, can't you see I'm all about you? Get on my money, sorry for it, it's not you. I can't walk. Get up, can't breathe, I'm losing my cool cause I'm missing you I go die if you know they would me not to say No one can feel your space, I go by if you know stay with me, hey No one can feel your space, I go die if you know they would me not to say No one can feel your space, I go by if you know stay with me, hey No one Girl, you best in my world, my personal babe I want you to take your place You are that I need, you're the reason I exist Oh, baby Wish I could bring back the days that you were mine I won't bring back the days when we did time If we bring back those days that we were one Spend the whole night, make me try it go I go die if you know they would me not true say No one can feel your space, I go by if you know stay with me, hey No one can feel your space, I go die if you know they with me not true say No one can feel your space, I go by if you know stay with me, hey No one can feel your space Ain't nobody's ever gonna do me like, like you. you Ain't nobody's ever gonna treat me like, like you Got nobody's ever gonna love me like, like you Come back to me, oh baby, please I'm not afraid. 